the things that we have to see in order to prosecute these cases. Uh, it's very, very disturbing. St. Charles County Prosecuting Attorney Tim Lomar says Howell's boyfriend, Jordan Prince, sexually assaulted the baby, then strangled her to death. You're watching the most shocking and informative LRJ TV news. Hello, I'm LRJ from LRJ TV. Oh, hell no. Uh, let's go says the mother knew her boyfriend was a sex offender and gave him access to her daughter. This prosecuting attorney also tells me that she sent some disturbing text messages. Since she's being charged, I'm glad. Jessica Howell was charged with child abuse and second degree murder Monday. It's about time and good, good work. The charges stem from the brutal death of her four month old daughter, Ashlyn. The things that we have to see in order to prosecute these cases uh, it's very, very disturbing. St. Charles County Prosecuting Attorney Tim Lomar says Howell's boyfriend, Jordan Prince, sexually assaulted the baby, then strangled her to death. They can't defend themselves. Nobody can speak for them. The one person in the world you think who would be able to speak for them and stand up for them and provide them security would be their parent. As the investigation continued, Lomar tells me some text messages sent between Howell and Prince were found. And in those text messages, she suggested and she uh, encouraged him to commit some unspeakable acts. Lomar says those unspeakable acts happened in a trailer at Deerfield Village the morning of December 3rd, 2012. Every once in a while I see him carrying it in and out. Johnny Zell lives across the street from the scene of the murder. So it's just... You know, it's unbelievable. I can't even imagine that happening. According to the complaint, Howell was in the trailer when Prince sexually assaulted and murdered Ashlyn. He's charged with first degree murder. Ezell hopes both are convicted. You hate to see baby killers go free. Let me just say this I reported a lot of stories, a lot of sad stories, funny stories, but this one right here, it takes the cake. Because who in the hell is they right mind? Four months old. Four months old. Rape the child and then strangle it and kill the child. And the person is a registered sex offender. Lord have mercy. You got to be kidding me. You this and you know what? Here is a registered sex offender with a girlfriend with a child. No bells went off. Nobody's watching this guy. Once again, people, this proves my point. Having all these websites about sex offenders is pointless. People don't give a shit. I'm LRJ. Rate, comment, and subscribe because you be glad you did. I love you all. Peace.